Hello everyone. I'm Ted. And today we will start with Chapter 7. Placement, Induction, and Socialization. Let's start. Content. The topics covered in Employee Induction Program may be stated thus. First, Organizational Issues. History of Company. Names and Titles of Key Executives. Employees Title and Department. Layout of Physical Facilities. Probationary Period. Products slash Services Offered. Overview of Production Process. Company Policies and Rules. Disciplinary Procedures. Employees Handbook. Safety Steps. Second, Employee Benefits. Pay Scales, Pay Days. Vacations, Holidays. Rest Pauses. Training Avenues. Counseling. Insurance, Medical, Recreation Retirement Benefits. Third, Introduction. To Supervisors. To Co-workers. To Trainers. To Employee Counselor. Fourth, Job Duties. Job Location. Job Tasks. Job Safety Needs. Overview of Jobs. Job Objectives. Relationship with Other Jobs. Moving Next. Follow Up. Despite the best efforts of supervisors, certain gaps may still remain in the orientation program. To overcome such communication gaps, it is better to use a supervisory checklist as shown below and find out whether all aspects have been covered or not. Follow-up meetings could be held at fixed intervals, say after every three to six months on a face-to-face -face basis. The basic purpose of such follow-up orientation is to offer guidance to employees on various general as well as matters, without leaving anything to chance. To make the process of orientation more meaningful, the company should make a conscious effort to obtain feedback from everyone involved in the program. There are several ways to get this kind of feedback. Through roundtable discussions with new hires after their first year on the job. Through in-depth interviews with randomly selected employees and superiors. Through questionnaires for mass coverage of all recent recruits. First day on the job. Supervisory checklist. A new employee may be anxious about starting a new job. Try and create a comfortable environment and remember not to overwhelm the employee. On the first day you should give a warm welcome and discuss the plan for the first day. Tour the employee's assigned workspace. Explain where restrooms, refreshments, and break areas are located. Provide required keys. Arrange to have lunch with a new employee. Tour the building and immediate area and introduce the new employee to other staff members. Introduce the new employee to the person you've identified as a buddy, if appropriate. Review job description card. Review the departments, or offices, organizational chart and explain its relationship to campus. Review your office's policies and procedures including Working hours Telephone, email, and internet use office organization, files, supplies etc. Office resources, directories, dictionaries, style manuals, computer program manuals, staff listing, etc. Staff meetings accountability. Customer service philosophy confidentiality. Ethics. Review employee work area to ensure needed equipment is in place set up a brief meeting with the employee and the assigned buddy to review the first week's activities, if appropriate. Schedule meeting with department personnel manager to complete required paperwork review personnel policies and procedures learn about benefits, health and life insurance, select benefits, etc. Schedule campus new employee orientation, if it has not been scheduled. Explain time cards review vacation slash six slash personal leave policies obtain UCID obtain parking permit, if appropriate. Have appropriate office personnel review, after hours and weekend office access general review of accounting, 
if appropriate, listing of account numbers, if appropriate, journal vouchers, if appropriate, travel and reimbursement diners club credit card campus mail services office supplies. Copy machine and fax use review office safety issues, computer competency with CalPAC self-assessment tools, if appropriate, overview of policies and procedures, including confidentiality, and software piracy issues assess knowledge of department's hardware and software. Moving next. Socialization. Socialization is a process through which a new recruit begins to understand and accept the values, norms, and beliefs held by others in the organization. HR department representatives help new recruits to internalize the way things are done in the organization. Orientation helps the newcomers to interact freely with employees working at various levels and learn behaviors that are acceptable. Through such formal and informal interaction and discussion, newcomers begin to understand how the department slash company is run who does what within the department, how to behave in the company, what is expected of them, and so on. The socialization process, usually, involves three major steps. Pre-arrival stage. The pre-arrival stage explicitly recognizes that each individual arrives with a particular set of values, expectations, and attitudes. The employees undergo some kind of training wherein they are oriented on how to behave in different situations, in work organizations. Encounter stage. In the second stage, the individual encounters the possible dichotomy between his expectations about the job, his co-workers, and the organization in general. If the expectations prove to be compatible with the needs of the organization, the individual is able to handle the job well and get along with his co-workers smoothly. But where expectations and reality differ, the new hire must undergo socialization that will detach him from his previous assumptions and replace them with another set that the organization deems desirable. Reality shock occurs when new hires perceive discrepancies between their pre-employment expectations and the job reality. The larger the gap, the stronger the reality shock. Reality shock, of course, is quite common in many organizations. The employer might fail to put the new hire on a challenging assignment, as promised. Resources and information required to do the job satisfactorily may not be forthcoming. Of course, at the extreme, a new recruit may become totally unconvinced and disillusioned with the realities of his job and eventually resign. Proper selection would greatly reduce the chance of such an occurrence. Metamorphosis Stage Finally, when everything is hires internalize the learned behaviors that is, feel at home understand how to handle the jobs and get along with people well then the socialization process is said to be complete. Successful metamorphosis will have a positive impact on employee productivity and commitment. Organizational socialization is thus, a process of learning and adjustment, where new hires get to know each other, understand policies and procedures, learn the tricks of the trade adjust to the new environs and carry out work without violating norms or rubbing people on the wrong side. For some people, as research evidence indicates, the adjustment process is fairly rapid. In any case, new hires with diverse work experiences seem to adjust better than those with limited previous experience, because they seem to possess a larger toolkit of knowledge and skills to make the adjustment possible. Moving next, Induction Guidelines The following guidelines could help in putting everything concerning orientation programs in place. Be open, frank, and honest on your values system, vision, mission and integrity definition. Be clear and transparent on organizational strengths and improvement areas in terms of culture, leadership, and business portfolio. Leverage differences we believe in diversity, there can be growth and a challenge to grow. Share information openly, clear all doubts of new hires and provide clear job instructions and find out how the new hires are doing in their respective jobs from time to time. Before arriving at a conclusion, better to give time for the new hire to adjust new environs and the culture of the organization. Focus on people, rest will follow. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching. This video is brought to you by 
books too. Like this video to encourage us. Share this video to spread the knowledge. And subscribe to this channel for latest update.